Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I don't know why I do this shoulder thing, I'm so sorry. Um, so welcome back. Today I will be doing a an affordable sleigh, which is what I gave you over here, 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 here. <laughs> um, so, but before that, pause this video and be sure to subscribe to my channel. Okay, now that you're done. <laughs> um, if you are interested in seeing how I achieve this look, um, please carry on watching. I usually um, start off with my eyes, but I don't know what I'm doing. So we're going to apply concealer and everything and then we'll go back to the eyes and then, yeah. So I'm going to go in with my LA Girl Pro Conceal. LA Girl is just killing the game right now. And then I'm just going in with this loose powder. I'm gonna go in with papaya don't peach papaya don't peach preach sorry preach papaya don't preach and it's a beautiful orangey color so yeah I'm just gonna use that as my transition color so in the crease Now I'm going to go in with 
Sunlight X no Starlight Espresso into the crease as well. It is like a stony kind of brown. And that's gonna go on top of that color. <laughs> And then I'm going to also add my first copper wear party and it's this kind of shade there is a lot of fallout with these products so be aware okay after that I'm gonna go in with plump up the jam and it's a purpley, purpley like shadow, purpley, purpley sparkle shadow, like a dark purple. And I'm going to just put it into my outer outer crease and blend it in. Then I'm going to take. This is a very ratchet eyeshadow um, thing I used to use if you saw my earlier videos you'd know um, it's this so I'm just going to use the lighter shade and then just also add it onto all of these colors I know it sounds like just adding and adding but uh, it's making sense so add it add the brown <laughs> going to add Rosemary's Baby to my lids just to lighten it up a bit and it's a nice pinkish shade so I'm, go I'm going to use one of these brushes and I'm just going to apply it onto my lid cute Rosemary's Baby it feels like it feels so wrong to put a baby on my lids <laughs> so then what you want to do afterwards is go in again with the brush that you use go into the brown shade I'm going to use this one, and I'm just going to use a darker one because I need a darker tone. Okay, so then I'm going to add a bit more of Rosemary's Baby onto my lid. Then I'm going to go straight into contouring and I'm going to use this one which is literally like I don't know what I'd do without it So I'm just going to use, I'm going to try out this one to keep it as affordable as possible because with this literally it cuts out so much. So I'm going to use this highlighter but I'm also going to be using my makeup finishing spray from Woolies. And this is also so affordable, so affordable. So that's all you do and I'm going to see if it's actually worth it. Let's dip it in generously because it's like a subtle glow. You know we don't do that here. Actually, maybe we should do that a bit. Because I don't want to blind you guys once again. Ugh, so inconsiderate. Just 
taking the brush that we used before and swirling, swirling it in there. Just want to highlight your eyebrow, your brow bone. So can we pop in? Yeah. And then the other side, obviously. Okay. And then you know all my lip lip combos except my Mac is is affordable. So so I'm gonna go in with my satin mauve lip liner and line my lips. And I'm just going for my LA Girl once again. Um, my matte, um, velvet matte lipstick. So this would be um, in Snuggle. So this is the finished look if you like this video please give it a thumbs up please comment and subscribe i have nothing else to say but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time